20 to 25 years from today, rather than put an implant in, we'll be able to resurface the joint biologically. The future really rests in a number of different areas. One is the prevention of failure of what we're currently doing. So we have a very active laboratory here looking at why implants fail. The second thing we're looking at is the biological changes that occur around an implant where it fixes itself into the bone. And because wear of these materials can occur, because there's so many cycles of motion between that ball and the socket, that the body can respond in a negative fashion and it can stimulate the production of cells which in fact break the bone down around the device. We're interested here looking at biologically the cellular mechanisms involved in that process and how we might block that process from occurring. So I think in the future, somebody will have a hip replacement, they may take one tablet a day that would prevent that cell to form. And you're probably looking at maybe 20 to 25 years from today rather than put an implant in, we'll be able to resurface the joint biologically with growth of cartilage that either stop the arthritic process or once it occurs, treat it early to prevent it from becoming a severe problem.